Fire investigators won't rule out arson as the cause of the third bushfire near Portland in as many days. A farmhouse was evacuated and water bombers called in as fire burnt through grassland. Cooler, damper weather over the last 48 hours has helped ease the situation. Nathan Stitt reports. A blaze between Portland and Cullenbullen reignites. Scrambling to a familiar fire front, the Rural Fire Service is called back to protect sheds, livestock and homes. After seeing 200 hectares go up on Thursday, the RFS weren't taking any chances. With help from the sky, the situation was under control by 5pm, but 24 hours later, fireys are called out to this. We got a call about 7 o'clock on Saturday night and responded uh, four appliances. Residents in a nearby home were evacuated by police as firefighters battled to get these flames under control. Eight, nine hectares has been burnt and the fire was, was contained by the appliances and the help of a little bit of rain. Returning to the scene of the blaze this morning, fire investigators scoured the hillside for any sign of what could have started it. The Rural Fire Service says it's responded to a fire on this hill every year since 2006. As to how this blaze started, fire investigators say they can't rule anything out, including arson. Very unusual. Rarely does that happen um, accidentally. So, as I said, we'll, we'll look at all aspects. Three fires in 72 hours for the Portland unit. It was busy around Orange 2. The Canobla Zone says it fought five fires over the weekend. Brett Bowden says property owners need to take care when burning off. Well, we don't want to discourage people from actually getting rid of that fuel before summer. Um, but we do want landowners to really take a few precautions. Nathan Stitt, near Portland, Prime 7 News.